What's good in Forever 20? So today we are going to make a coffee table, a floating coffee table. And with these six pieces here, they go by 22 inches by 5 inches. And this one here, 18.5 inches by 5 inches. They are also six pieces. And this one here, they are also six. And they are a square of 22 by 22 inches. Yeah, those are the measurements and I will also uh, put them on the description box for those who will have not understand maybe. Yeah, I'll put the measurements, I'll write all the measurements on the description box for you to understand well. And now I'm making my square box, then drill them together to make that square. Yeah, so if you're new to this channel, you're so much welcome and thank you. Thank you for clicking. And if you're a returning subscriber, thank you. Thank you so much for always coming back. So keep watching and please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't. Join the Team Forever 20 family and you'll never get disappointed. So your girl got a drilling gun and you won. And if you want this, you can get it at any hardware. I bought mine at 3500 That's 35 USD, US dollars. Yeah, so if you want one, you can get yours at any hardware. So let's work. And thank you all for your support, for your contribution, for those who contributed. Thank you so much. You helped me get this one, and I'm grateful for that. So let's continue. So I'm going to drill some holes here. I'm going to make some pilot holes so that the screws will be easy to be drilled through. Yeah. So keep watching to the end and please give this video a thumbs up. Comment down below. Share to your family and friends. And make sure you watch to the end so that you see the final, the final product of this piece of table because i love it so keep watching make sure you share to your family and friends don't forget to give it a thumbs up yeah so i worked on this on on all the three pieces and i'm going to screw them one by one and um if i can tell you this drilling gun it's so easy to use you don't need some knowledge to use this drilling gun it's so easy yeah when you when you're buying it you just ask for how to open it how to reverse and all those then you go ahead and use it yeah it's so easy for those who don't know for those who think that it it maybe it is hard to use or something it's so easy to use yeah so i, I worked on all the three pieces on all the squares then now I'm going to work on piece by piece. So keep watching so that you can understand. And if you love this table, you can also give it a try. And if you want to purchase one like this, kindly DM me on my Instagram at Christinore and I'll leave the handles here and also at the description box or DM me on my Facebook page at Christine underscore nore also yeah and we can communicate so here i've decided to use some nails so that i find it easy to use nails yeah to use nails just to place this the the, the top part so that the mirrors can lay flat yeah and this the bottom part this this is the one which is going to be the bottom that's why i left the I put the white part at the bottom for it to be neat, neatly done. Yeah, so keep watching because I'm talking so much. I'm talking too much. So keep watching to the end and make sure you give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up.
so I decided to add this piece here at the bottom which uh, has a measurement of 10 inches by 8 inches yeah and I'm drilling it at the bottom and after this I'm going to uh, place my mirrors which I'm using my silicone glue and my hot glue because I don't want to hold them using a tape but you can just uh, put the silicone glue then use a tape to hold the mirrors until they get dry but I had to use my my hot glue so that they can just hold while I continue working with the rest of the mirrors yeah and that's it hope you are enjoying watching this video up to this far mm, and if you are kindly give it a thumbs up don't forget to give it a thumbs up comment down below share to your family and friends leave a sweet comment and tell me how does the uh, the final look how does it look how did it came out huh yeah how did okay that's it so keep watching and i also did the same process which i'm using at the middle part i also did um flow a mirror flow lamp using the same technique so if you haven't watched that video i'll leave the link on the description box make sure you go and watch it because it's amazing it came out so nice so make sure you go watch that one too And that's how my final looks how does it look tell me in the comment section because I love it I love it so much it looks so so pretty look at that look at that make sure you give it a thumbs up yeah because your girl did a great job look at that I covered the this part here and the top is not sharp as you can see that here look at that and for those who will be asking about the tray and the flower vests I have a video on that and make sure just make sure you put on your bell notification on so that when i post that you get notified immediately because i'll drop the video very soon the the edges are not sharp at all at all at all so this is safe even if you have a kid around this is safe the table is so nice look at that Thank you, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for clicking back. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you, thank you, thank you. Until next time, hugs and kisses from Christine.